Welcome and welcome back to my channel. I'm Nett, a self-taught baker, curating weekly quick and easy recipes. And in today's video, I'll be showing you how to make your own fruit roll-ups, only three ingredients. So if you like making your own sweets, hit that like, leave me a comment with any questions you may have, and also subscribe and consider joining the family. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So starting off, you want to select the type of fruit you want to use and in today's video I'm going to be using some dark sweet cherries and I'm just going to fill up the whole blender with the cherries. Next, we'll be adding our lemon juice. Lastly, we'll be adding one fourth cup to honey. And now we're just going to blend everything until it's nice and smooth. And y'all, just as I was recording this video, I lost that piece. So I'm using a towel just so don't let that come squirting out. <laughs> So periodically you want to go ahead and um, just scrape the sides just to make sure all the fruit is well blended. And then we're going to continue to blend till it's a little more smooth. Now we're going to just cook down our frozen fruit just until it get nice and thick. And you want to make sure you just do this on medium high heat and continue to stir. Continue stirring so that way your mixture don't stick to the pot. Now that we brought this up to a boil, we're going to go ahead and turn it down to a simmer and let this cook down for about five minutes. So once you're done, we're going to go ahead and place our fruit on top of a silicone mat or you could use some parchment paper, but my preference is the silicone mats. It just make baking so much easier. Now this part is very important. You want to make sure you create a thin layer and make sure it's nice and even because if it's thick in the middle, it's going to be harder or take longer for you to, um, you know, dry out. So you want to just make sure you create a nice even layer. Now we're just going to place this inside the oven for about eight hours on 170. And this is just going to dehydrate the fruit to make it nice and leathery. So once it's out the oven, we're going to go ahead and take some wax paper just so it can make the cutting process easier. And we're just going to rip that parchment paper and place it down for our candy. 
So now that our fruit roll up is out of the oven, it is nice and dry to the touch and it cooled down. We're going to go ahead and peel it off of our silicone mat. Y'all look at that shine on that fruit roll up. And this is what we are looking for. So you want to make sure it's nice and shiny once you peel it off. And then we're going to completely take it off the silicone mat and place it on our wax paper. And now we're just going to cut these into some slices so that we can roll these up. Now we're just going to roll it up like so. So now I would like to take this time to thank all of my channel members. Thank you. Thank you all for joining my membership. And if you have not yet subscribed to their channels, I will link all their channels down below. So y'all go ahead and check them out as they are amazing content creators as well. So join my membership today for exclusive perks and monthly giveaways. And our first giveaway will be February 1st on my birthday. So y'all stay tuned. So once your fruit roll up is completely rolled up, you can store these in a plastic bag or you can leave these out. These stay fresh for about a month so you don't have to worry about them going bad. So just like that, we made ourselves some homemade fruit roll ups. Y'all, these are so easy to make and these are good for the kids as well, being that it's not so much sugar and you're using practically all natural ingredients. So y'all, this is how it came out. These are all of my roll-ups and I hope you guys try this recipe. And if you like this video, please hit the like for me and also consider subscribing and joining the family. So until the next video, you guys, y'all stay safe out there in peace. And if you enjoy content like this, please check out my other videos.